Hello, good to have you with us on Red Barn Radio. I'm Brad Becker. This is season 19 of Red Barn Radio, and tonight we welcome you to show number 740. <laughs> our staff and our artists so appreciate that you continue to visit the Red Barn Radio YouTube and Twitch channels to enjoy our Wednesday live streams like this one tonight. This week we bring to Red Barn Troy Burchett and his band. Burchett's emotional lyrics and controlled Elvis-esque vibrato are pure country. After years of tuning his craft in Nashville, Burchett's style has matured, and in 2019, the Troy Burchett Band entered into the Kentucky Music Hall of Fame. Troy has a new CD called One More Time, coming out this fall, if not sooner. Please welcome Troy Burchett and his band to the Red Barn stage. <laughs> Down 
Good evening, and welcome to Red Barn Radio. Wherever in the world you're listening, welcome to Roots Music Southern Style. Thanks to WEKU, Red Barn Radio's official radio partner, NPR for Central and Eastern Kentucky. Listen online at WEKU.org. Red Barn Radio is supported by Visit Lex, Lexington, Kentucky's Convention and Visitors Bureau. More information on what Lexington has to offer is at visitlex.com. LexArts, Lexington, Kentucky's premier cultural development, advocacy, and fundraising organization, working for the development of a strong and vibrant arts community as a means of enhancing the quality of life in Central Kentucky. Follow Red Barn Radio on Twitter and like us on Facebook. Here's the host of Red Barn Radio to tell us more about tonight's performers. Well, hello, listeners. It's great to have you with us. On the Red Barn stage tonight with Troy Burchett, or David Bentley on percussion, Ken Burchett on bass, Larry Wayne on guitar, and Steve Porter on keyboards. Troy also has a new music video actually featuring some of the players on the stage tonight. Please welcome Troy Burchett and his band to the Red Barn stage. Well, it's great to be here with you guys. It's an honor to be at Red Barn. We really appreciate the opportunity. The song I'll do for you now is called Something About You. Wrote this song a little sometime back and uh, hope you guys enjoy it. Well, my hands get sweaty, knees get weak. You are here and I can't even speak. You feel the room, hey baby, catch my eye. Yeah, I can't see why. There's just something about you. Well, eyes and lips and hold those fingertips, oh baby, please. Have mercy on me. I can't say what it is There's just something about you Hey, Larry! Hard races, pulse pounds Butterflies, when you come around, I lose track of time. I get lost in your eyes. I can't say what it is, there's just something about you. Well, it's that pretty smile, lovely eyes, the way you light me up inside. Faint stare, playful glare, the way you hold me and you with the goodbye. I'll be every word to describe what you do with somebody you hey, hey, hey. I can't eat, I can't sleep, no doubt. I'm in deep, yeah, your love is gonna kill me, but what a way to go. I can't see what is, and just something about you. Well, it's that pretty smile, lovely eyes, the way you light me up inside. Faint stare, leave a glare, the way you hold me and you whisper goodbye. I'll be every word to describe what you do. There's something about you. Take me home, Larry! Hey, It's great to be back here at Red Barn. We really enjoy it, enjoy the opportunity. I got the chance to write a lot of songs, and uh, 
to me, every song tells a story. It's not just words to me. I write about things I feel and things that uh, touch me and move me. And uh, we've been having fun. This next song, <laughs> it's called Worth the Price. It's a really cool, fun song. And we've had a chance to play at a great place called Music Paradise with uh, Tracy Sloan. And we've had fun down there. They have parties and banquets and dinners and birthday parties and anything. So we really appreciate Tracy and Music Paradise. And this song is for you, Tracy. So. <laughs> That you gave, girl, I gave some to you. Know that you wanted more than I could give you. I never promised you easy, never promised you fast. But I promise I will always be there. My baby, love don't come easy, I love don't come fast. It's forgiven and take on I baby, I swear It's not who you're wrong or right Who wins this fight tonight Love don't come easy Who's worth the price? How about it, Steve? So before you walk out that door, give me the benefit of a doubt. I've been together such a long time, baby, don't walk out. I know it hasn't been easy, yet I give your love to me, but I promise you, baby, you can't depend on me. Baby, love don't come easy, I love don't come fast. But it's take on Yeah, baby, I swear It's not who wrong or right Who wins this fight tonight Your love don't come easy But it's worth the price Tell me about life, baby Never be able to give you all that I like. I promise you, baby, my love will last. I know life is a struggle we can face together, but I promise you, baby, you can depend on me. Baby, love don't come easy. I love don't come fast. Let's give what else to Hey, baby, I swear It's not who wrong or right Who wins this fight tonight Your love don't come easy But it's worth the price Take me home, boys! Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Like I said, I write a lot of songs, and um, I want to send that one out, that one out to uh, uh, Tracy Sloan at Music Paradise. We really appreciate those people. They're very good people, and uh, we're honored that they uh, gave us a chance to play there, and we're thankful. So I want to do a uh, great blues tune for you. I, I like all different types of music, country blues, uh, southern rock, oldies. So um, when I write a song, it's not about what genre it is to me. It's about how I feel at the moment. And uh, so uh, Steve's making fun of me in the corner over here. We picked him up along the west guy on the keyboard. So if you, if you seem familiar, we probably brought him this way. So uh, here's an old tune. It's called Who's to Blame? I don't know who's to blame. It must be Steve. So thought I could find calm. 
at the bottom of a bottle. What's my troubles away? In a misty, misty haze, baby, just go now. Don't feel a thing. But there's some things, Mr. Daniels, just can't wash away. Baby, who's to blame? Was there anything worth saving? On is a shame that we end up giving away. You get the house and the kids. I'll take these memories with me. Baby, who's to blame? Baby, no one over me. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I appreciate that so much. That is a, a special song. It's uh, a song I wrote many years ago about uh, someone that I knew, and uh, he never could figure out who was to blame until it was too late. So It wasn't me, Larry. Larry's up here whispering sweet nothings in my ear here, so I had to bring Cowboy with me. I want to do a very special song for you now. Uh, this next song I wrote and I uh, got to record it in Nashville at um, Dark Horse Studios and uh, I'm really proud of it. I wrote about someone very special that came into my life some years ago and actually changed it and made me a better man. So thank you, baby. This song is for you. Yeah, 
No, it's not you, Larry. Put your parent in a ponytail, boy. Come on. So here's, here's a great song. We love doing this song. I, I love singing it. And um, I hope it touches you out there. I hope you got someone close to you you love. And if you don't, maybe this song will make you find someone. So it's called One More Time. Can't take these boys anywhere, can I? Man, we got to get a bus or something and put them on it. All right, guys, here we go. Let's take one more ride out and eat the stars tonight. Maybe one more walk down by the lake. Let's cuddle up, baby. Let's stay all night. Just hold each other to the morning light. And if I could turn back time, if I could change your mind, if I could bring back yesterday one more time, and if I could make you see, honey, what you mean to me, if I could make you love me one Dance out on this floor tonight. Maybe one more kiss beneath all these lights. I hold my hand so tight, whisper you love me, love me one more time before you leave. And if I could turn back time, if I could change your mind, if I could bring back yesterday one more time, if I could make you see, honey, what you mean to me, if I could make you love me. If I could turn back time, if I could change your mind, if I could bring back yesterday one more time, and if I could make you see, honey, what you mean to me, if I could make you love me. nice if you're just joining us you're listening to the troy burchett band uh troy has been with us on red barn radio before and i hope uh hope you had a chance to hear him then and now um troy i've enjoyed reading up on you and my preps for the two shows we've done together uh, and I, w I would encourage any of you listening out there to go to troy's website and learn about the variety of things he's done in his life um I thought maybe tonight, Troy, I'd like to sort of build a telling of your story from ground up so we can maybe better understand the, the roots of your music sure. and the things you've come to feel uh, passionate about in your life. I, I wonder if you might start us by sort of rapping on the door of your childhood memory and recalling when music first touched you. Well, I was born and raised in eastern Kentucky down in Prestonsburg, Florida County, and uh, my father was a pastor of a church, and my mother was the worship leader. So what happened, um, as I grew up, music was just a part of everyday life, and 
And in church, I started to sing some as I got older and uh, really loved it, enjoyed it. Um, I wasn't always the best, but I got better as time went on. And uh, uh, one thing that uh, when I was a kid, as I was learning to sing, I loved it so much I would sing and sing and sing even before I really learned how to sing. So I made money getting paid to stop singing. <laughs> It became, a, I, I, wow, I can make money at this. Hey. So, hey, it took off from there. <laughs> well, I was going to ask you, you know, what the, the, the place was that you associate with, with that, that time in your life when music first touched you and the person. And I think you, you answered that. So and the, I, I guess it's church. Either. Yeah. I guess it, it's church. Yes. And, um, and then uh, your dad? Mm -hmm. Yeah, my dad was a pastor of a church, yeah. and we traveled a lot. And, did, uh, and eventually, as I got older, I became part of the worship uh, in, the, in the church service, so it was just an every week thing, um, sometimes Saturday, Sunday, Wednesday nights, and all that kind of stuff, so it got me into music. Yeah, yeah, and so at, um, at what point in time did you feel like, hey, I'm ready to, um, I'm ready to be a, a, you know, a practitioner of this art as a band leader? Did that happen for you as a, as a teen? Uh, as I got into my teens, yeah, I uh, started to dabble a little more in uh, country and blues and still did gospel and all types of stuff and still do. Uh, but at that time, there was festivals around, so I thought, well, you know, I enjoy this. And they gave me a chance to sing in some of the festivals, so it just kept branching out from there. Festivals led to other venues and uh, dances and still do. I play at banquets, dances, dinners, weddings. I've done weddings. I've even sung at funerals, so huh. those are the hardest to do. Yeah, I'm sure they are. Yes. That was a beautiful song you Thanks. did uh, for Denise. Yeah. I, I, I think we can assume that's, sa I think it's safe let's to say that that's for Let's Denise. don't tell her and give her the big head. You well. know. <laughs> so kind of figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, Troy, I guess I'm wondering um, about, the, about the, the writing piece. Were you impacted by, um, by any particular artist? Uh, oh, yes. As a, as, a, as a writer? Well, when I was a kid, it was all types of music. My mom and dad loved music and my family, and they'd have, you know, get-togethers, and we'd play on the back porch. Uh, to me, music isn't just a genre. Uh, we would play everything. It didn't matter from bluegrass to, to rock. And we'd get together, and just the family would bring instruments, and we'd play. So I guess to me, a lot of stuff that I was raised on would be Elvis Presley, Carl Perkins, Roy Orbison, uh, George Jones, Merle Haggard, Johnny Cash, um, gosh, Bruce Springsteen, huh. all those different types influenced me. Well, especially the, the Perkins and Elvis comes out loud and clear. Is it, is it okay with you that people uh, describe your vocals as Elvis-esque? Is that That's fine. intentional? Yeah, yeah. I just enjoy singing. So whatever it comes out, comes out. It yeah. doesn't matter to me. If it's Elvis or Roy Orbison, I'm a big fan of his too. So uh, all those genres really appealed to me. Brian Adams was a great singer. Mm. Uh, I liked Guns N' Roses, Kiss, Sting. Oh, wow, yeah. <laughs> John Cougar Mellencamp. So, you know, just a whole wide variety of different things that influenced yeah. me. Sort of runs a gamut. So uh, yep. tell, us about the, uh, tell us about the next couple of songs you have coming up. You, you have one, uh, Hard Letting Go, and then Place I Want to Be. Uh, well, the Hard Letting Go is a song that I wrote um, some years back. I have an opportunity. I also dabble in acting and theater. And um, they gave me a role on a web series called Fifth Holler. And uh, you can go on YouTube and watch some of the episodes now. I play a deputy sheriff in a police department and uh, <coughs> gets in trouble here and there. And there's fights and different things. And uh, so I wrote this song, and uh, they loved it. So they now use it in their soundtrack. Um, so, Is that a show that, that uh, continues on Yes, today? we're filming the final season now. We have, I think, uh, two or three episodes left to film of that. And it'll be wrapped up. Uh, but... Uh, it's How terrific. Fun. And then the name of it one more time? Fifth Holler. Oh, all right. Good. It's well, really good. And it's, it's about and a small a town series. and uh, what goes on there and all the corruption and some mysteries of people being kidnapped. And uh, I have to fight my way to find some people. And it's really uh, cool. Cool. Is it specifically a Kentucky town? I mean, like, yes, does it sort of follow Raylan. the path of Justified? It's Rayland. It's called Rayland, Rayland, Kentucky. And it's, about, it's an old oh, coal mining on. town that's kind of went bust. And they have all these old ab abandoned mines for... Somebody is kidnapping girls and keeping them 
Hmm. Won't say where, won't say who, but uh, it probably is Larry over here. I don't know. That's point. Yeah, I think it's that guy over there yeah, wearing the shades. Yeah, it's a long-haired guy over here. That's, that's the guy. Uh, and was, so that, w- that was hard letting go. What about Place I Want to Be? Place I Want to Be is actually uh, my friend here, Mr. John, uh, Mr. Larry Wayne's song. He wrote that. He's actually got a CD going to be coming out, too. So I'd like to claim that song, but I can't. So that's Okay, well, that's all right. That's all right. Well, good. So those are a couple of tunes coming up. A mm-hmm. couple of tunes coming up right shortly. All right, folks. Welcome to Red Barn Radio. You're listening to the Troy Burchett Band. Let's get back to some music. All right. So <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. It's great to be here. Uh, as I said, I wrote this song sometime back, and um, we really enjoy doing it. And I love the song. It's uh, actually being featured on Fifth Holler. But a good friend of mine down in Floyd County uh, hangs out all the time at uh, uh, Pro Fitness. Uh, Judge Blue Markham um, is a good friend of mine. He loves this tune, so I want to dedicate this song to him and appreciate him listening. So. There's a cold, cold wind blowing here tonight. A chill in the air. Oh, there's something ain't right. I see the writing on the wall. I hear the bell toll. It loaded so hard, letting go. And I close my eyes, you're all I see. Your haunting voice, and baby, touches me. Touch these walls, our memories flow. And loaded so high, letting go. Try to smile for all your friends. Try not to show I'm a broken man. Let's say be strong. God knows I try. And load it so hard, saying goodbye. And I close my eyes. You all I see. Your haunting voice. Baby tortures me. Touch these walls, our memories flow. And Lord, it's so high, 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 go. Hey, Steve. Traveled miles, a thousand miles I've gone. What I wouldn't give just to go back home. These Kentucky Hills, they called me. Lord 23, please take me home. I close my eyes, you're all I see. Your haunting voice, baby, tortures me. Touch these walls, our memories low. You know it's so hard, 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 letting go. Ah, thank you so much. We have a good friend of mine, Mr. Larry Wayne, our lead guitar player, and he also does some great vocals, writes some pretty songs. Don't tell him I said that because he gets all hiffy on me. So he's going to do you a beautiful song he has written. It's also got a CD. And it's very pretty, so I hope you enjoy it. Lying here beside you You're a million miles away Though we said it was over I want you to stay Sometimes 
tune for you guys that I wrote. Uh, it's a good song. It's summertime, so we'll get with it. Y'all ready? Brush off the sound will wash away. Memories made together keep us close every day. With the salt in the air, the wind in your hair, it takes me back to palm trees and 80 degrees. We spend a day. Every night, baby, walking the beach, just holding hands. When summer was over and we went our separate ways, all I could think about was how I wish that you could stay. With the salt in the air, wind in your hair, it takes me back to palm trees and daily.
You've got your life, and baby, I've got mine. The love we made will fill my heart for all of time. If you think of me, I hope a smile will cross your face. Cause when it does, just remember those days. The salt in the air, the wind in your hair. It takes me back to palm trees and daily Hey, before we get on with more music with the Troy Burchett Band, I want to tell you about next week on Red Barn Radio Livestream, we have the sound of organic synth pop from the South with the Sunmates. What's organic synth pop, you might be asking? Well, organic synth pop, uh, according to the band, is a cosmic connection of nature with city, and their brand of it they also call unrefutably Southern. The Sunmates are excited to play and talk with us about their unique Musical expression of the place they all call home. Open your ears to all the South has to offer. That's the Sunmates. Next time on Red Barn Radio, the program that's been bringing you Roots Music Southern Style for 20 years. How about that? Hey, and now let's get back to tonight's Red Barn Radio program. We come to you live on all of our social media platforms, broadcasting from the Arts Place Performance Hall here in the Grand City of Lexington, Kentucky. And now, folks, please welcome back the Troy Burchett Band to the Red Barn stage. They'll be performing a tune that I think was just made into a music video. Is that right? Yes. All right, Troy. Let's do it. Troy I'm, Burchett Band. I get to tell you all about it. So I want to do a very special song for you now. We, uh, <laughs> we had some fun making a video, a music video out of Nashville for this song, and uh, they really liked it. So uh, it's a fun tune, dance tune. We're just going to have some fun with it. Hope you do, too. So, Brother Larry, would you do me the honor, sir? Jumps in, flashes at the mouth. Looks me away with the grace and style. Makes me feel like I'm the only man. Sick of her lips, smell of her skin. Fires me up again and again. It's like... Gasoline and fire. Well, come on, relax that smile. Close those eyes. Buckle up, it's a bumpy ride. Lay back. And lean out to a curve. Pedal to metal, and away we go. Where we stop, Lord only knows. Bumper to bumper on a dead end road Going places we never go Ignoring the signs That's how she rolls Gone high blowing in the wind Lord help me I'm giving in It's like gasoline and fire Well come on relax that smile Rose gold eyes Bible up is a bumpy ride Lay back Middle to middle and away we go Where we stop alone only knows you yeah. oh, That's my girl playing life Oh, 
down the middle and away we go Where we stop, Lord only knows you oh, That's my girl That's my girl Thank you so much. We're honored to get to do that song for you guys. We shot that video, and we're very excited about it. It's going to hit TV hopefully this fall, and uh, so I hope you guys will request it. Tune in for the radio stations. Now I'm going to ask my good friend, this guy, I met him along the way somewhere, and uh, I want to thank all these guys for playing with me. I appreciate them very much. We have fun together. We play together, so it's not a chore. <laughs> so Mr. Larry Wayne's going to do a couple more songs for you now. Come with me, let's walk by the river tonight The moon is hot, shining oh so bright There's a passion burning in your eyes Take my hand down this path so many times Why don't we give this thing a try I can feel our love growing deep inside Hold me close So much, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. 
Living life without you, babe It's harder every day Everything's so different Many things I needed to say I couldn't watch you leave My heart just wouldn't let me see yeah. The tears were my memory Goodbyes ain't forever And goodbyes ain't the end They only mean I miss you, girl Until I see Or just wouldn't let me see yeah. The tears were my memory folks uh you are listening to the troy burchett band and that last number was uh done by larry wayne who's here on uh, on guitar and larry i would venture to say that um you are maybe one of the only people on this stage who i've not met here before is that true yeah i've never been here before all right well tell us uh tell us where you've been when you've not been here <laughs> uh, now, what do, what do you do? Do you, you uh, what, what do you do outside of music? No, nothing. I play music for a living. Oh, all right, nice. And and what's your uh, what's your other gig? You you play with Troy and yeah, I help Troy out. Yeah, uh, and well, I guess anybody, you know. The, yeah. When I'm when I'm not busy, of course, I and when doing my own thing or whatever, I'll help all kinds of people out. And uh, other than that, when I'm not on the road, I stay home, watch the dog. Oh, all right. And the kid. Well, your influences your influences are, are uh, pretty clear. We got a little we got a little taste, a uh, little appetizer before the show. We could hear oh, a little yeah. Gary Rosington, maybe, and some Collins, and some Stevie Ray, and some Hendrix, and oh yeah, is that uh, is that what you grew up with? Well, I had a little bit of everything because my mother li listened to one kind of music, you know, like Doctor Hook and pop and stuff like that, and Easy Rock, and my dad listened to hard rock, and then, you know. Uh, some of my family members played bluegrass, so I had a little bit of mix of everything, but I kind of leaned toward the rock and the country. You know, that's kind of where I 
found my spot, you know, somewhere in the middle, and uh, I saw his shirt when I walked in. Uh -huh. Freddie Mercury by, by, is my favorite vocalist of all time. That's what made me want to sing was listening to Freddie Mercury. Oh, all right. And so I, I found my happy place, I guess, somewhere between George Strait and Leonard Skinner. Ah, nice. That's where I like writing my music at, you know, and that way I can kind of get a little bit of both country and rock in there. You play other instruments too? Yeah. Yeah, what I else you play? I play drums, let's see, bass. Uh, some people are probably not going to know what this is, but a didgeridoo. I've been learning how to play a didgeridoo. Oh, all right. What, what, uh, and, what uh, compelled you to, uh, to go that direction <laughs> with your rock music? <laughs> <laughs> I love the movie Crocodile Dundee. <laughs> and I watched those all the time, and I saw that in there. And we were, I don't remember where we were at, but my drummer that I have, found one in a music store and bought it and brought it to me and I was like oh all right you know so then I commenced to driving everybody in the house nuts you yeah. know trying to learn how to do this thing yeah I would not let you in my house playing one of those uh, Larry it's awesome I mean I <laughs> like I've threatened like painting myself up you know and then running through the neighborhood with that and just terrorizing everybody <laughs> yeah yeah hey Larry good to meet you good to meet you too bro yeah yeah um hey uh Troy you told me the other day, uh, and which is why I mentioned it earlier, that you just released this music video. Is, is music video um, Im important for conveying the messages of your songs, or, I mean, to the point where you feel it merits the, the, the work and the expense? Well, it's, um, it's one of those things where if you really want to get your music to a mass audience, you really got to get in the genre. So visual now is one of the biggest... Uh, aids. So if you want to market, say, my CD's coming out, so the song is going to be That's My Girl. So now we shoot a video for that song, which in turn markets that CD. Yeah, so it's kind of a roundabout way of doing it. So I, since I haven't seen the video, can you d describe it? What's it, what's it like? Oh What'd you do, what did you decide to do in that video? Well, and who helped you decide? Uh, I want to give a big shout out to uh, Bobby Cyrus and Teddy Cyrus. Uh, they helped me out a lot and uh, we're going through a company out of Nashville, and uh, so um, we did some crazy stuff. Now, I'm, I'm going to say I teach martial arts and I teach yoga in Prestonsburg, and so the director thought it would be a kick if I could uh. do jump spinning <laughs> kicks in the air to the music. Let's just say that some of that may not have all worked out like he'd hoped. <laughs> well, <laughs> I had to buy a new pair of pants, too, so you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Oh, man. But now we do have some special effects in the video, and we got some fire and uh, power tactics and all kinds of stuff. So oh, it's man. Really cool. All right. Well, really I'm cool. w when are we going to have a chance to see that? Uh, it should be coming out probably in a few weeks, hopefully. Uh, it's been, I'm told it's done uh, with editing. So oh, as soon on. as I see it and we have the screening and the company gives me the go ahead, we're going to start putting it out. Well, so will you please let us know when that, sure uh, when that happens? Yeah, because I'm definitely going to want to see that. Uh, you know, is. Um, that, that leads me to the next thing I was going to ask you about. You know, over the course of 20 years and 700 and some shows, we've spoken to musicians who were high school teachers, who were coal miners and park rangers and even lawyers and doctors. But uh, we have not spoken to any musician on the show who was a champion at, at, uh, at beating other people up. <laughs> um, <Yeah. laughs> which I know that's not what martial arts is. But what, uh, tell, tell listeners about your history in the craft of martial arts. Well, when I was a kid, my dad uh, had studied martial arts, and he was in the military, and he wanted to teach me some, mm. and at the time, I needed it, so I was a small little runt and uh, needed help defending myself, so my father was my beginning teacher, and then from there, it branched out. I went to different martial arts schools, and finally, I uh, got to study with Carlson Gracie Jr. and did some jujitsu, and... Uh, and in 2001, I fought in the Battle of Columbus. Arnold Schwarzenegger has a big thing in Columbus, and uh, I won the world championship out there. Had a great time competing, and it was fun. And like I said, martial arts is not really about winning a trophy, but it was yeah. fun to try. And uh, so I had, had a good time. I took a team. I, I trained fighters, and I took my school down, and they did well, too. So that was really good. Wow, that's, that's, uh, that's amazing. Uh, for, for parents um, listening, what can their kids learn in martial arts that – makes it uh, is as valuable, if not more valuable, than, uh, you know, say, soccer or music lessons? Well, the big thing to me is discipline and honor. So whatever you're studying, martial arts, soccer, football, basketball, your kids should come home better people than they went. 
So for example, if you, if you study jujitsu, what I teach, you have to be able to defend yourself, but also you gotta be able to have good character. In other words, if I see you on the street and you're starting fights and I cut you from the school, we kick you out. We don't tolerate any stuff like that. So we teach character, honor, discipline, the things that are needed badly. And uh, self-confidence is also a big thing nowadays too. Hmm. So I suppose you could bring those principles into any kind yes. of coaching or any kind Depends of teaching, right? Coach. Yes. So yeah. yeah. Well, that's, that's, uh, that's really, uh, really cool to hear about. Hey, what's, um, what's coming up in, uh, in the future for you? What, uh, what other kinds of things do you have going on, um, say, d during this summer? Well, we've got a lot of shows lined up. I'm going to be in, um, let's see, Moorhead, Louisville, Lexington. <coughs> um, I'm going to be at Allen Park with my good buddy back here. <laughs> we call him Kay. And uh, Skins. Yeah. So we're going to be at Allen Park playing. We're going to be in we'll be in Nashville some. Oh, I nice. got to play at Tootsie's, and I played at uh, some other things out there. But the big thing for me this year is to get this video out, get the CD out, and try to m try to push that and see how the how the songs do. If people relate to the music, and uh, I want to give back a fun sense to music because to me, music should be fun. It should move you. Should brighten your day really, and that's what I try to do with my music. Yeah. Yeah, well, you do that, and uh, we, we're really glad you could come on to Red Barn. I enjoyed uh, having all you guys here. Uh, welcome back to those of you who are coming back, and welcome to those of you who are here for the first time. Let's welcome back the Troy Burchett Band to Red Barn Radio. Lord, I felt like I was caught in a trap. Never ending circle of pain. I hurt you, baby, you hurt me. But there's no one to blame. Why can't we just walk away? I, who am I to say? I don't know about you, baby. This ain't how it's been It doesn't gotta be free, baby. Pack my bags and leave. Just gotta be free, lady. Go where the road takes me. Get in my car and drive. I never look back again. Leave these heartaches behind me, baby. Just gotta be free, hey Steve.
Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. We appreciate that. That's called Got to Be Free. I, like I said earlier, I write songs about things I've lived, loved, lost. To me, music is a uh, storytelling art, and it tells you about the person's life. It's not just words to me. I want to send that song out to my good buddies down at El Rodeo's Mexican Restaurant in Prestonsburg, where I am affectionately known as Taco Man. <laughs> send it out to my good buddy, <laughs> Nacho, and all the guys down there. Hey, I can't help it. I like tacos. What can I say? Lenora's always good to me and sets us up, and Michelle. So thank you guys. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it very much. I want to do a song for you now that I uh, wrote some time back. Um, I think I mentioned earlier I lost my father uh, some years back, and uh, that's a loss you don't really get over. So I wrote this song. It's called Only the Walls Know. So. Sometimes it's just you in the house by yourself and uh, no one else knows what you're really facing or living or going through. So um, I hope this song touches you wherever you are and makes you relive a part of your life because that that's what music is supposed to do. It's supposed to move you. Yeah, but I'm right where you left me, girl Just hanging on But if these walls they could cry Put out all the lies no one knows If these lies they could go Of the stories that they hold So many go Voices from the past, shadows on the glass, we'll love the world. Take us home, brother Larry. Make me cry. Yeah, 
If you got a little something for me, Steve, take me out with it. Thank you, thank you very much. <clears throat> I wrote that song uh, some time back, and I enjoy doing it. We have a good time with it. We're going to be traveling a lot this year in a lot of places, Lexington, Louisville, Frankfurt, all over the place, Allen. <laughs> so uh, I really appreciate these guys coming and playing with me. I want to do a couple more songs for you and uh, say a big thank you to you, Brad, and all the people here at Red Barn Radio. It's an honor to get to play with you guys, so I really appreciate that. I want to do a song. These next couple of songs are really sad, Brad. So uh, if you have any hankies and you want to pull them out, it's okay. I won't even notice. Um, I wrote this song about my father. He passed away of cancer um, some years ago, and uh, it changed my life and uh, moved me in a lot of ways. So I so, uh, hope you guys enjoy this tune. It's really sad, and uh, it really touches me when I do it. And I, It's hard for me to do it, actually, but... Uh, Music is great therapy, too. So these guys are going to play really, really different and soft, and so just enjoy the song. Seems like yesterday I was just a boy Holding on to daddy's hand Thought those days would never end I felt so safe and secure From the world outside the door But that was before it slipped in Someone tell me why Does anyone even know How someone in the prime so strong and so wise I slip away so quickly way before their time cancer takes the body but the spirit survives Just a matter of time So the doctors say Through the trials and the treats We watched him slip away Yes, it left him weak and feeble But it couldn't shake his faith He said cancer takes the body But hell Lord, someone tell me why Does anyone even know How someone in the prime So strong and so wise And slip away so quickly Way before their time Cancer takes the body But the spirit Lord, there will come a day when we look upon your face and loved ones that we've lost along the way by your grace.
Thank you. Thank you very much. <clears throat> That's one of the hardest songs that I do. Uh, it uh, brings back a lot of memories and uh, all that kind of stuff. So. Troy. We would, right. like to, we would like to thank Troy Burchett and the band for being with us this evening. We also thank our volunteers and staff for their help in making our production happen each and every week. Thank you all for listening to our webcast, watching us on YouTube and Twitch, and those listening to us on the network of Red Barn stations and, and media worldwide. Thanks to WEKU, Red Barn Radio's official radio partner, NPR for Central and Eastern Kentucky. Listen online at WEKU.org because it's your chance to hear more great live music from Red Barn Radio and WEKU. Those of you here in the Central Kentucky area, you gotta be sure to check out Red Barn TV, our weekly program of music now on ABC 36 WTBQ. Red Barn Radio comes to you from our home, the Arts Place Performance Hall in downtown Lexington, Kentucky. Our website has updates and further information on our guests and our program. We're on the web at redbarnradio.com. Now, once again, uh, Troy, I wonder if you have time to bring us one more tune to see us out tonight. Sure do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay. Hey, that's Troy Burchett and the band here on Red Barn Radio. Give him a hand. All right. <clears throat> We're going to do a song for you now. It's a very slow song. I wrote this. I said I travel a lot. I wrote this in a hotel room somewhere with shadows all alone one night, and this is what came out. So it was just me and the walls, and it seemed like the shadows were talking to me. So I'll do this for you. It's got a, it's a real pretty tune. So drift away with me. I close my eyes Get lost in time Minutes to hours With you by my side Daylight comes The sun slowly rises The shadows fall Across your face Sweep me away to a special place Sweep me away And let's get lost Lost in this moment Drift away Maybe just for a day Hide away Where no one can find us Baby, please Drift away with me. Lock the door. Close the blinds. Unplug the phone. Lose track of time. Touch your hand. Taste your lips. Smell your skin. Tonight's mine again Sweep me away To a special place Sweep me away And let's get lost Lost in this moment Drift away Maybe just for a day Find us, baby, please drift away with me. Count the stars one by one, could I buy the fire to the morning comes, sweep me away to a special place. Sweep me away. God bless you and thank you. Well, that's all for our show for this week. You can see and hear Red Barn Radio worldwide as we stream live on the web on YouTube and Twitch Wednesdays, 7 p.m. Eastern in North America. Archive performances on Spotify, 
and video on the Red Barn Radio YouTube channel. Be sure to check out our social media for updates to upcoming schedules and more information on the Red Barn Radio program. Now, from all of us here at Red Barn Radio to all of our friends worldwide, it is our hope that you have a great week. Keep working together to be safe and healthy. And until next time, good night. <laughs>